Our goal is to fly to incredible altitudes in the stratosphere. We need very special conditions to fly into the stratosphere. Yes, this glider does actually do what we designed it to do. The dream was born for Paralon Mission 2. A lot of uh, individuals got involved to make that dream a reality. We've come to El Calafate in Argentina. Our goal is to get into some rising air. We're looking for areas of lift that will enable this aircraft to get into the upper reaches of the atmosphere. And there's only a few places on Earth that have stratospheric waves. We can put the glider into a patch of air that is going up at incredible speed, 1,000 feet per minute. You know, the same kind of speed you're climbing when you're in an Airbus airliner. We're going up at that speed, and it's actually nice to fly. The virtual cockpit gives us all the information on the ground that, that we need to know if the flight is progressing safely and smoothly and that we're able to continue to progress higher and higher. We've added even more to the virtual cockpit. So this year we have a live video feed from the tail camera which should immerse the user even more into the flight experience of Pearl Am. We look at the pressure in the cockpit in the capsule. We look at oxygen that, that the pilots are breathing. We're looking at the battery. We're looking at temperatures at various instruments. If you want to be an innovative company, you have to be doing things that nobody else is doing, trying things nobody else is trying, and doing them in a way nobody has done them before. Perlin is an amazing opportunity that you don't get very often. We worked with a small school that's trying to form hypotheses and get kids inspired in science technology. Aviation is a fantastic potential career. There is true adventure, true exploring here. The perspectives you get from flying high, the freedom, the enjoyment have just been fantastic. Mm -hmm.